Hey guys, in this tutorial I'm going to show you how you can create a sky sphere in Unreal Engine 5, so let's start. So first you have to get an HDRI for the sky and I would recommend using HDRI Heaven or Poly Heaven. And if you're on Poly Heaven you just can go to Assets, HDRIs and then maybe to Skies and then pick a sky from here. I like this one. I will choose 8K for this tutorial, you can choose 16K, but maybe Unreal Engine crashes with 16K, so for the tutorial 8K is fine, and then I leave it at HDR and I click on download. Also if you're using the HDRIs commercially, I would recommend you to read through the text about the license. Okay, and once in Unreal Engine, I just load in this Sky HDRI I downloaded before. And let's go into this texture because we need to change some things. So the first thing is to set the texture group from World to Skybox because of course we're using this as a sky sphere. And also you have to change the color from HDR to user interface 2D and then we can save this texture. Now let's create a new material and call this sky material or something. Let's go into that and now we need to search for cube and we need this texture sample parameter cube. This is for our sky sphere. And into that, we load in our sky texture. So let's search for it and apply it. Also, you have to change the sky material right here from default lit to unlit, because if you leave it at default lit, there will be shadows on the sky sphere and this will just look weird. The next thing we need is the reflection vector WS. Let's plug that into the UVs and what this will do is just get rid of all the reflections we have right here. Currently those reflections are still there because the standard value is at 1. Now you can press 1 on your keyboard and left click to get the scalar parameter and just plug it into there. Okay and you see the reflection has disappeared. Let's preview it. This is the before and this is the after. Okay, let's save this. And the only thing we have to do is go to our SM underscore sky sphere, then grab our material and apply it. And as you can see, it got perfectly applied. Okay, now you only see half of the sky sphere and the other half is just a dark bluish color. And this is because of the exponential height fog. You can just turn it off and then you have only the sky sphere. For example, if you want to do a space game or something, then you can turn the exponential height fog off. But in normal games, you are on the ground and you have a horizon line and then you can turn the exponential height fog on without any problems and this just works perfectly fine. Okay guys, I hope you liked this video. If yes, leave a thumbs up. If no, leave a thumbs down. I'll see you next time and bye.